Welcome back, guys, to Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. We're last episode. Traveling over to Corel's Dust Bowl, we found a familiar face in the form of Leslie awaiting, who in his search for his girl had learned that a woman from Midgar was being used as a prize for the winner of the Beast Battleground, leading our party to enter and free her. With Leslie's search unfortunately continuing, we moved on to the Gold Sorcerer at last with the Gold Cup to compete in. So, with that said and done, little Beaumont is waiting over here. Our destination, Find Dio, is over there. The side quest we want to go to is off, of course, at Chocobo Square. What do I do first? There's going to be about a billion different things for me to partake in. Actually, speaking of which, uh... I mean, obviously, I could fast travel to here, right? Oh, I have to go to the thingy, but... Just wondering if there's any way to see what other minigames might actually have new stuff. Because, of course, the star's next to the thing. Musclehead Coliseum, of course, has new stuff, but we've known that for quite a while. <laughs> yeah, Galactic Saviors has a new thing. Uh, every tier of the arcade has a new thing. The question is, do I do them first or later? Everything is ready for me to go. Let's go first and do the side quest that we've picked up. That is the thing that makes the most sense. <laughs> Got cars, etc. I can't go through there. Sorry, I'll go through the main bit then. Sorry. Even if I'm at the gold saucer, it doesn't mean we'll be proceeding with stuff that fast. Let's put it that way. A magical day, you say. Oh, hey, clouds. Got some news. Apparently, the powers that be like what we have to offer. Gave us permission to race in the Gold Cup. So I went and signed you up as soon as I could. After all, you're the best jockey I know. The Cup is three races, and you get points based on where you place in each. Bird with the most at the end wins. But the races are nothing like you've ever seen before. You gotta be on the ball if you want to take the top spot. Anyway, when you're ready to face off against the finest riders this side of the continent, head on over to registration. Yes, sir. Go Cup Joe, eh? Which of these races will you be competing in? New difficulty level has been unlocked. The Gold Cup is now available to gold ranked jockeys. The pinnacle of Chugwa Racing is run over three legs, and the jockey with the most total points after all three takes home the cup. Try to decimate the competition by placing first in all three races, which will earn you a flawless victory. I've gotta earn I've gotta earn a flawless victory. Oh shoot, man. You must be at least gold ranked to compete. There's 10 races in silver before the gold race? Okay, supposedly winning one more allows me to do the gold cup. Well, let's get started. Let's take you because we know that Choco Bubble allows you to shoot people. Homes in on targets too, that sounds great to me. You're also the straight up fastest. You just not got the acceleration to go with it. Do I need acceleration? Increases speed, increases acceleration, increases weight. Let's go with the acceleration. Let's go with the scorpion helm. Sure. We're ready to go. You never did go back to these races? Well, I don't know when they unlocked. I didn't do much backtracking, no, throughout the game. Oh, yes, two. It's two. Sex, not R2, like the cars. Damn it. <laughs> I went fast. I went slower so I didn't have to compete for the blue things, you know. As. I'll have this choker bubble soon, then you'll be sorry. 
That was a good corner, wasn't it? Wait, you're bouncy things? I kind of fluffed it a bit, but... Help! Are there slow panels? My speed's at zero because I've been bumped. Well, this isn't a good start. So every time I get bumped, I lose one speed balloon at least. Oh, this is a bad, this is a bad go. But my weight's pretty high, so I should have won, like, the trade. was evidently very, very wrong. We're still on the first lap. What the crap? <laughs> I mean, to be fair, everyone's within obviously seeing distance in front of me. So it's not like it's terrible. You should be getting used to the attack. I guess I just want to be straight up faster, which I'm not. This guy's faster than me. Finally have my first dash. There's only one person in front of me now. Should be evens. Oh wait, don't be like putting your hands up in the air like you're beating me. Man, you're like right on me. Oh, I missed them all. It's fine, I got my bubble. Oh, I thought it was gonna hit me then. He overtakes me, I'm gonna shoot him. Wow, these are really long tracks. <laughs> are they combining two different tracks? I feel like that's what they're doing. Wow, it really does feel like the old chocolate racing now. And my opponents can't be that far behind me, right? What if it's better to take the short one or the big one? Speed wise. Keep spamming the R1 button. Go faster, mate. I can't really discern how far behind me they are. I'm now regretting taking acceleration. I don't think I need it. Unless acceleration boosts the boost. <laughs> Might have been a little risky biscuit. Oh, I'm, I'm like a full bend ahead. Fire the chocolate bubble. Screw last place. <laughs> Five minutes of race. Right, we did get promoted for the gold. So we can now compete in the gold cup if I wish to. That's grade one. What's the other rewards? Oh, there's like Hyperion gear to get. Maybe that's like the best gear. Maybe we'll get- we'll farm out the best gear first, right? Must be a legend-ranked jockey. 
Sure, let's become a legend ranked jockey and then play the gold cup. <laughs> We're gonna do it all because we do everything. <laughs> Except the hard mode. A full condo. Of course. The Shiva Ice Fields. A race designed for stretch use with ice in their veins and drifting on the brain. If you find a chilling water troublesome, use the ramp to jump over it. I'll take you again, and I'm going to increase the speed and weight again. It lowers your intelligence, though, to wear Shinra stuff. Makes sense. Alright, the last silver race. This truly has been a session of side activities. But you do expect to do a fair bit of clear out when you're nearing, obviously, the end of the game. Oh, not the gates! <laughs> Chosen correctly. I've not been hit by a gate yet, so I don't know why I'm saying, oh no, not the gates, but I think it's fairly obvious. Just... Well, these switched, did they? How far in the lead am I? <laughs> Ah, 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 the dangers. <laughs> Can I shoot them? <laughs> so this is a one thirteen lap. Aren't I wearing boots that make it easier for me to walk on board, by the way? I think I am. At the moment, I almost feel like they. I, I, I almost wish they were just one lap braces. Mainly because they very obviously don't have like Mario Kart systems in place. Not very many weapons, if any at all. Uh, on top of that, there's no rubber banding. So if you're running good and your speed is high. What honestly can these guys do to catch me up without me super messing up? And look at the, the gap that's been made off just that lap. I didn't think I was making that one. Oh, no. Wow, I lost so much speed off that. Okay, well, I've already gained my advantage massively. My first mistime cactuar gate. That said, it's really not hard to regain your speed. What the hell? I don't really think I lost much in the way of uh, distance because of all the blues that were right near it. Segment past the Cactuar gate that's basically like, oh, did you lose some stuff? Here, have it all again. I lost two seconds on the Cactuar gate stuck. Leviathan Riptide, a race with lead changes as volatile as tempestuous ocean swells. Memorize the placement of each obstacle to navigate these rough waters with ease. What was it again, eh? Quite like the high speed build. High speed, high weight. Don't know if they count out each other out or not.
The other thing, I don't think the chocobos that we're racing have their abilities. I don't think the opponents have... They, they can't shoot anyone, right? I don't think they can. Oh, someone's got a bit of a... Uh, my chocobo is driving to the left randomly. That was not me pressing that. I can guarantee you that. Stop hitting me! <laughs> okay, that's bad. <laughs> My chocobo does not corner well on these specific corners. That's not good. Oh, my blue. Oh, the yellow's that way. Shortcut right. Shortcut right. Oh, they took the shortcut. How dare they? <laughs> Fire the chocolate bubble. Fire. Well, I never wanted it to hit the opponent anyway, obviously. The other ones who, like, homed into the close target pretty easy. I was expecting to do the same thing. So I'm not a cornering god. Losing more speed every quarter. <laughs> Maybe a little more cornering couldn't hurt on a track like this. Okay, we well, took the shortcut this time. I think they're on the strange straight as me. So I still need to not mess up. Like that. That was bad. Okay, they're straight behind me now, but I'm going to hit the wall again here. Oh, thankfully, there wasn't a wall. And I'm going to target this. And then realize that I'm just going to crash into a wall in a second. So I'll lower my speed. Maybe. I don't know. Corner properly. Because you can deal with a lack of cornering by lowering your speed. Uh, like this. <laughs> that would make sense. Be it artificially or not. The Ramu Bolt, a race that rewards chocobos who are as quick as lightning. Zip past the competition by keeping an eye on the track's many hazards. Hopefully a shorter lap race. 
I do wonder how much of this game was like taken out of the Chocobo Racing game that kind of messed up based on its uh, season passes, etc. that was out not too long before this. You've got to think how many iterations of just Chocobo Racing there have been in games of theirs on top of... I didn't get the boost. That's the problem. Here we go. Whip, whip. Whip, whip. Ah, oh, man, he took my step. Oh, I so thought I'd get through on that. I guess I didn't really slow down. Ooh, corner. But since Chocobo Racing was a thing, there's been I mean, more than one game. And then more than one iteration. 14 has an iteration. Where's my speed at now? I think the track design's getting a bit more interesting. How did you overtake me? No, I mean, I didn't think I was racing that all that badly. Do you ever slide faster or not? Oh, God. That is a barricade. Not got full speed. Now I do. So hopefully we can leverage it. I need like a bigger boost than just that. For holding really long, nice, cool dress like I just did. Through two turns. We're going to be good, especially if I boost it and uh, then s stop entirely. What the hell? <laughs> that was interesting. I guess if you go into a drift and you let go of X with the jump, you literally stop dead, which wasn't terrible. Okay, I've lost some of my speed again. There's a guy actually on my ass. I think there's a red chocobo directly behind me. Is it orange? I think the gap has been lengthened. As long as I don't hit an obstacle, I should be home free. This time I've taken this corner correctly. <laughs> not this turn it's the turn coming up it doesn't have like a real indication okay that gateway gets the boost it's the last turn out this one that i need to turn in right way sooner there we go right that's Nearly half of them down. The Titan Slam now.
Taking note of what and where each obstacle is, split yourself and the rest of the field by doing that. A race made possible by the rending of the earth. We get Hermes shoes for this. That's an accessory, correct? <laughs> I want a game that is like farm ranch game where you raise, breed, train and catch chocobos. I mean, that could be in the third iteration. But I don't know at this point. I mean, it was part of the OG. <laughs> I've been waiting for it to reappear, but I guess maybe they think that people won't uh, have the patience to do chocobo breeding. I mean, it's in Final Fantasy XIV after all, all that chocobo breeding. But then also the final reward of what was chocobo group breeding was a thing that doesn't really super translate. to this iteration, I guess. Oh, God. Evil room you've got here. Okay, there was a better corner to take, or a faster one. Why is the floor misty? I don't like that. Is that the strategy to hop over it? <laughs> I'm not even kidding. I was just like, uh, they seem to be in a weird pad. What if I hop? My imagination, or is this quicker than the quick one? I feel like those are fairly easy to get past. Famous last words. As long as there's no bombs. Bombs will do E4, you know. I just think I'll take the long turn again. I don't see what I have to gain by taking the short. If I'm out in front. Seems to work, I don't know. A severe lead now. But then I say, like, about having... Maybe they don't think people have the patience to do Chocobo breeding, but the amount of minigames they put in this, of course, is a talking point. i fine with, like, playing these games, you know what I mean? Hell? Oh! Dash! <laughs> That's where he is. Final Fantasy VII did, of course, have a lot of minigames. Not this many minigames. But it did have a lot. Which, of course, a lot of these were derived from. And that's another win. So I don't think there's a lack of patience in the player base for doing Chocobo breeding if they... For those, they're completionists. You also just need to make sure it doesn't gate anyone off of anything. Or, you know, massive. Like, top rewards. Like was the OG, it's completely fine. We're on the Kajana Stampede. Everyone will push their limits during this race. Its hairpin turns require impeccable drifting skills, while the numerous obstacles demand split-second decision-making. Okay, so this time we supposedly need drifting. Is there speed and cornering? Randomly replace your current ability with a different one you possess. Sounds terrible. I want extra cornering, really. Is extra intelligence really what I want? This is going to change my build quite a lot here, but now I'm a dinosaur. 